Weather. Have you ever experienced this scenario? What comes to your mind when you see this scenario? Are we thinking the same thing? Hmm. May bagyo. When will it happen? And when will it enter the park? Hello, I'm Mom Naila, your science grade 8 teacher. Let us review your previous lesson. In this activity, you will choose a letter with the correct terms or statements inside the box. Choose your answer from the word bank. The answers can be in any order. You only have 15 seconds to answer this activity. Let us check your answers. If you got all the answers correct, you are excellent. Let us have a game. The title of the game, Guess the Sound. For the mechanics of the game, just like the title, you will going to guess the sound related to typhoon. For number one... What did you hear? What did you hear? For number three, what did you hear? For number four, what did you hear? Typhoons are big whirlwinds in which air travels in a large spiral around the center of extreme low pressure. Pag-asa or Philippine Atmospheric Geophysical and Astronomical Services is the official Philippine agency that forecasts the weather and other climatological conditions that affect the country. Philippine Area of Responsibility is an area in the Northwestern Pacific where Pag-asa, the Philippine National Meteorological Agency, monitors weather occurrences. Let us do an activity. The title of this activity, Dot, Plot, and Connect. The objectives of this activity, to plot the Philippine Area of Responsibility using the latitude and longitude. And then, let us plot the following points on the map. Connect the plotted points, the region within is the Philippine area of responsibility. All typhoons that enter the park are monitored by Pag-asa. Now let us plot the given points using a dots. And then, we will going to make a line from point A to B, B to C, C to D, D to E, and E to F. As you can see, that is a Philippine area of responsibility. Question, what bodies of water are covered by R? Very good, Pacific Ocean. If the Typhoon A is located at 15 degree north, 138 degrees, is it within the par? If your answer is no, you are correct, the Typhoon outside the par. 
If the typhoon is at 19 degree north, 170 degree east, is it inside the park? No, the typhoon outside the park. X, this is the track of Typhoon Yolanda. Let us study. In what body of water did Typhoon Yolanda originate? If your answer is Pacific Ocean, you are correct. What direction did Typhoon Yolanda take as it crossed the Philippines? If your answer Northwest, you are correct. Name the peak Thermometer It measures the air temperature Name the peak Barometer It measures atmospheric pressure Name the peak Anemometer, it measures wind speed. Name the peak. Hygrometer, it measures the water vapor content of air or the humidity. Name the peak. Psychometer, an instrument for determining atmospheric humidity by the reading of two thermometers. Remember, typhoon are giant whirlwinds in which air moves in a large spiral around the center of extreme low pressure. R stands for Philippine Area of Responsibility is an area in the northern western Pacific where Pag-asa, the Philippine National Meteorological Agency, monitors weather occurrences. The direction of typhoons in Philippines is northwest. Meteorologists use a wide variety of different instruments to measure weather conditions. 